Now we're ready to add the characteristics of the animal. So what you can do is go back to your animal research, open that up, and we can go and look at what kind of physical characteristics or how it looks. So I see that it's 4 to 15 feet long. Okay, so what I can do in my diagram, I can put that. We're going to go up to the shapes and go down to the arrow. And I want to find the arrow that has a, bat, a left and a right arrow, where both of the arrows are on the ends. I'm going to click on that, and I'm going to start right here where the tail begins and go all the way down to the very end of the body. That shows me that from the tail all the way to the head, the hammerhead shark is four to five feet. So what we can do, now we're ready to add a text box. I go to the T for text box, click, and now I'm ready to start typing. Four, two, five feet long. And if I need to go back and check, four to 15 feet. So Miss Rachel made a mistake, and if that you make a mistake, that's okay. We just can click, we can fix any mistake. If I accidentally delete something or move it, ah, don't forget, you can go to your undo button, and there it is. I can even make it a little bit bigger by going, making it, okay, four to 15 feet long. Now I'm ready to go back next door, and I find another fact. It has a hammer-shaped head. So I'm going to think, where's the head? This is where the head is. So I'm going to go up to my arrow, and this time I can find a regular just down arrow, and I want to point my arrow to the head so that that's what I, I'm talking about. Now I'm ready to go to T for text box and click, and now I can add that in. So hammer shaped head, and I'm going to write that in. Okay, you're going to keep going until you have all, all different things all set here. You can even go back to Pebble Go if you want to find more facts about your, the animal. So go ahead and you can complete your diagram. And when it is finished, you might have something like this. Enjoy!